Record Store Day is a twice a year event where the largest labels all the way down to your indie labels release some of the hottest releases of the year. Um, this has been going on for about 10 or 15 years now, but at this point it's kind of gotten to the point where everyone's involved with it for the most part. We do try and carry as much as we can of the titles that people ask for. I can't stress enough if you miss something, let us know when the record store day list drops. It drops every, I'm wanting to say February and like September-ish. And every single time we do, we, if that happens, you'll see Fresh Produce Records putting out a solicitation and saying, hey, what do you want us to order? How much of this do you need us to get? Um, we really try to, to work with our community and see what everyone wants. And then on top of that, I mean, we've got our online customers that we try and work with too. This is not just a like, well, I'll sit on my couch and I'll you know, order from the website whenever I feel like it. This is a like, well, if you, if you want that Taylor Swift record, you need to be here when the doors open and actually you need to be here, you know, two hours before the doors open at best. That might not even be, honestly at this point, I've had so many people call. I have no clue when people are gonna start lining up, but um, it's gonna be an eventful day. Um, there's always cool music. I mean, I've already got five or 10 titles that I'm looking at just as a music collector myself and saying, wow, that's really awesome music. There's always so much stuff uh, I always end up, we'll, we'll order what we want and then we'll take a second look at the list a few weeks later and say, how did we miss this one cool? Um, there is some obscure stuff on there that if you're not paying really close attention and listening to everything they put out, you're gonna miss a record store day title you should get, but that's kind of the nature of the game. It, it definitely does a job of encouraging people to dig deep and uh, the nature of Record Store Day with the like, this is your shot to get it. If you want to get the most out of that experience, the best thing you can do is when they put out that list of two or 300 titles, go start listening to stuff you've never heard of on it. There's so much good stuff on there that even if, I mean, especially I would say if you don't recognize the name, there's a reason that it's on there. 